Hey there, my gorgeous internet friends. In today's video, I'm going to get the distance between two points on a map. For example, if I click here and then here, uh, you can see the distance between these two locations here. I use leaflet.js for creating the map and calculating the uh, distance between these two points. Here in my index.html, I added leaflet CSS and leaflet.js a span with length ID for displaying the distance and a div with map ID for holding the map. In style.css, I have added some simple CSS rules for a better look and the only point is that you should set the width and height for the map container. And script.js contains uh, the script for creating a basic map that I have explained about it in one of my previous videos. You can check it it's, uh, if it's not clear for you. For calculating the distance, as you can see here, we need the latitude and longitude from this point and the latitude and longitude uh, from the end point. And we have two markers and a line between these two points. So I define some variables. Start point, end point, polyline for line, and I set the marker A to null and marker B to null. We should listen for the user click event, and so map dot on click and then call a function. Let's see what we have in our event listener. Here we have an object that gives us useful information, but for this tutorial we need this property, the latitude and longitude. Uh, and now I want to define some conditions in my click event. If it's first click or else if second click or it's third click. If it's first click I set the point A to E dot latitude and longitude of that selected location and set the marker A to and create a marker and set to marker A for that point and add to map. Okay, let's check it. Now the first marker is added. And if the second click, I do the same for adding the marker, just change the variable's name. The first marker and second marker, and now I want to uh, draw a line between these two points. I use polyline and pass an array of points point A and point B and add to map and I also want to change the color of the line. So here I add option the color and set it to red. And in the next step I want to display uh, the distance between these two markers here. And I use um, leaflet distance method to do this. And I need two points. And then I want to display it on the HTML tag. Okay, and um, now we can see the distance here. And if user clicks on the errors, nothing will happen, but I want to uh, let the user 
and know the distance between two other points. Uh, so here in RS, I check if polyline already exists. First, remove it. And set it to null. And and set a new uh, uh, selected location to point A and remove the markers and set the point B to null and create the marker for new location. Okay, everything works great. And that's it for today. I hope you found a few things that will be useful for your web project.